DSC is also commonly used for oxidative induction time analysis, or OIT tests. It measures the time it takes for a sample to oxidize in an oxygen environment. To run an OIT test, two gases are needed. One is inert gas, typically a nitrogen or helium. Uh, the other gas is air or pure oxygen. The software will allow you to switch from nitrogen to oxygen during the run. So first, let's start with sample preparation. A typical sample is a thin film, um, no more than one millimeter thick, and usually five to six millimeters in diameter. The best samples are usually having high surface to volume ratio to have best OIT test results. And the sample pans we use are usually the aluminum open pans. Other materials can also be used, for example, copper. But copper can catalyze the oxidative reaction. So uh, typically, aluminum pans are used. Cutting samples into the same thickness and size will help you to get reproducible results and help compare samples. First, you can load the sample in an open pan. Open the DSC cover, furnace covers, and slowly, carefully load the sample into the DSC furnace. There's already a reference pan made of the same materials, exact same pan as the sample pan already loaded into the DSC furnace. Now we can close the covers, and we can move on to set up the method. After the sample is loaded, we can set up the method. First, we start with the sample information and sample weight and the file name. Then we move to initial state. We start with the gas, nitrogen gas, at 50 mils per minute flow rate. And we add a heating step from room temperature 25 degrees C to 200 degrees C at 20 degrees C per minute heating rate. Then we hold it for five minutes. Then we switch to oxygen until the end of the run where the oxidative reaction has occurred. A typical OIT test usually lasts less than an hour. So if the OIT is longer than an hour, we can increase the temperature from 200 degrees C to 210 or 215. Uh, or if the OIT test shows very short OIT, then we can lower the temperatures. ASTM methods recommend 200 degrees C as the holding temperature. This is the results of LDP film tested at 210 degrees. We first have to calculate the first derivative of the DSC curve to locate where the steepest slope is. And then we can go to calc oxidative induction and find the left and right limit for the tangent calculation. Calculate. And the OIT is 9.623 minutes.